<laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my god. These are friendship bracelets in Taiwan. Some of them are just ridiculous. That one down there. Oh yeah, sorry for that delay, we're back. Uh, I haven't really been able to keep tabs on the match because we were busy checking out bracket stuff. Um, but man, Wins took a lot of damage real quick. I imagine Candy pulled like all out aggressive on him once he got into his face. A lot of up airs, most likely. Otherwise, un unless Candy decides to go in with like a burst of like damage, it's gonna be a pretty slow match here, guys. We're gonna we're, we're out wearing it for the long con. So, power the the, the strength that wins utilizes with Tomb League is creating that space, getting those bombs out, bombs, and then just pelting you to death until you have kill percents for like bomb forward air, boomerang forward air, that kind of stuff. Um, Candy is a player who's okay with playing that long range game with Fox. He doesn't. He's the, uh, pretty much a polar opposite when compared to Mega Fox, where he doesn't really fight. He's polar he, opposite he, of Fox in general. Yeah, like, he doesn't. Both play super aggressive, like Fox, but he just sits back. He waits. Uh, well, I mean, Fox Fox can play that way, and honestly, that's that's a lot more. Uh, I mean, yeah, well, any character can play word? either aggressive or campy, but it's like the optimal way with Fox is go in, get eighty percent from one hit, and he got one hit confirmed, but. Candy will just get some hits and go the other yeah. side, maybe. Candy's not a fan of like pulling out a ton of damage, but I mean, it's 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 pretty good to just sit back and wait for the error. But Candy's the kind of player that that prefers uh, unforced errors. He likes punishing those a lot more than he, uh, punishing he errors that he manipulates. So it, it, a lot of this match is going to be dictated by how often wins uh, gets pulls a bomb mid range. Yeah, pretty much. Well, that like just that, just basically any any, any unforced errors that that Candy uh, like see right there. He yeah, doesn't he doesn't, he doesn't commit he doesn't commit he doesn't pressure too much. He just sits at the safest possible spot in that in that situation and waits for wins to make the, the first move. Yeah, and if it's yeah, and if it's an unforced error like if wins the roll or something, then he gets that free damage on him and then he just resets that same position over and over again. That's almost like a candy special, just S-Smash on the ledge. Like, I don't see it's Mega Fox do it much. It's a good move. It, it lurches him forward, so it, make, it makes his hitbox a moving hitbox, which is really yeah. good. And it can kill at that percent. That looked Idiot. weird. That looked really weird. I couldn't tell if he pulled a bomb or a boomerang catch, he, like, killed him. I think he pulled a bomb. Oh, tried two-framing him with the forward smash. She can hit with the forward smash. It does hit a little bit below the level. So that, that is something that he would, he'd probably want at some point. That's another thing too, uh, Wins can play that long range game, but every time he pulls out a bomb he risks getting shot by a few lasers. It won't do too much damage, it'll do like 3%, but it, it adds up if you just let him shoot you forever. So you gotta be really careful with the way you handle that. Nice bomb to up smash by Wins. Gets Kenny to 77%. Okay, he retreats, gets a bomb hit. Bombs will do about 4% apiece, so he's gonna be taking uh, this damage on him over and over until he gets about 100. Up dare to auto cancel, baby. Oh, baby. The money's, the money's in that floor, that down there, dude. Oh, that was so he close. Was for it. Yeah, that was I don't so think it dangerous. Killed, but it would have been close. Would have put him in a really bad spot. Oh, wow, that was nice. He actually pivot, he he pivot up tilted and caught wins out of his roll. Yeah. We caught it. I think that third bomb he's caught. Yeah. But this is mine. This is mine now. Yeah, see, there he goes. Pulls a bomb, it takes 3% uh, for his trouble. And it, it's interesting because when he pulls out the bomb, he takes 3%, the bomb does 4. So, assuming he would hit the bomb, he gets a he wins a trip by 1%, but that requires you to hit the bomb, and the lasers are guaranteed to hit once you pull the bomb out. So, like, it's really funny because Candy, as long as he shoots him whenever he pulls out a bomb, 
he uh, unless he gets hit he's actually doing just fine in that yeah like what that decision making the big question is whether or not he can uh with the Nando's bombs the hit confirms are a big 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 deal yeah Man, I am I am feeling really tired oh, oh my god I should not I should stop drinking that stuff whenever I come over here there's probably like a ton of sugar in these things let me see I think we're going back to Smashville. Yeah, oh, man. Nah, don't it. The usual. The usual. This thing doesn't tell me. It just says energy. It doesn't say sugar. Energy is probably. Oh, there you go. Twenty point one grams of sugar. Thirty-four. Damn, this apple drink has a ton of sugar in it. So no I generally so think this game will be a timeout. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Duck Hunt. Like, wins chooses it, but you win, it's the, like... The stage of timeout. Yeah, it's, it's basically, I'm not going to fight. <laughs> I'm not going to fight Hunt. Well, in duck, when, you, when you're duck hunting, you, you need to be really quiet and patient. So it makes sense. Oh, no! has been a little more aggressive this time around. He's not really sitting back. He's kind of getting in win space. A bit of a mix-up in his... Uh, Playstyle. It's very interesting. I didn't. I haven't seen him be so in your face before. Yeah, but it, it is costing him some damage. Though. Ooh, it took five damage from lasers. But yeah, that that aggressiveness is costing him a little bit. But uh, real quick, he landing some up tilts. Man, that's ridiculous. Up tilt to short hop up air. It's 50-50 if you air dodge. That's disgusting. It's kind of nice that he's going aggressive on him, but he's not doing like outside of the attack. Oh my goodness, the bombs. Bombs. More bombs. I feel like if he sees winds run across the stage, just shoot his back. It's like, you probably will get 5 or 6 or 3%. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, that's free. Yeah, when it, Fox's Fox's L smash is like the one move that's just super easy to exploit because uh, Fox has a lot of cooldown on it. Like even Sonic can just like shield drop to forward smash, and Sonic's forward smash does have some startup on it. So I mean, most most smash attacks will land on Fox after you shield his up smash. Oh boy, look at that! Look at this! Look at this clown fiesta going on. Oh, he grabbed it with dash attack. I'm honestly surprised he didn't try grabbing at all. Like, he chased him, but they both he, just snipped Candy down. really wants to hit confirm. He doesn't really care to grab. So we're not seeing that too much. But that's going to cause him if Wins gets the stock first. Ooh. He saw the boomerang throw. Yeah. Throwing up the boomerang was really risky right there because they, they were about mid-range. Fox can close that gap really quick. Made boomerang throws really unsafe. Especially from how close he did at that time. It was bombs, bombs, bombs. I think right now he doesn't care that he's getting hit by bombs. Yeah. He can afford to take that. That's hard to run away from this ledge. Oh, that should be it. Yep. Nice. I thought he was going to wait for the air dodge to forward air, but he just goes for up air instead. Up air is really fast in the startup, so uh, kind of hard to anticipate unless you're, you like already know what they want. When you go to a weekly and lose with two foxes. <sighs> so they're kind of just like sitting back a lot. There's not much going on. Alright, there you go. That's some action. And we're back. <laughs> and we're back in the mix. Straight back. 2%. Oh, nice. He, throw, he throws a bomb to get invincibility on himself. Fox does still take damage for it too. So Fox took a hefty amount for that that the whole grab setup. Yeah. Oh no! 
basically, if you're in the middle of the stage, you're gonna go for up smash or bomb the fair, and then if he's near the ledge, you're just gonna pivot. Grab. Not much to say, honestly. They're just kind of running around, shielding, occasional projectiles thrown, or nothing that Candy's doing. I think he's just waiting for the mistake before he tries anything. And there's a mistake. The neutral get up. Now let's see if he can hold on to the stop. Oh, I don't think that was worth it. Lasering at mid range just got him to lose the stock. Fifty percent shield up time. Like wow, wow. <laughs> Slow matches. There's a minute left. I just realized that. Yeah. Minute thirty-five. Put the one down here, by the way. They landed a hit too. You know, the first down air just match. Yeah. This is. Spooky for wins because he's at he's at a percent right now where like two three more hits will put him in that kill range. Oh, yeah, put him in that kill range. But he's so far away. He, like the gap is slowly widening between him and Fox. Like he has to find something magical to hit with right now. Whether it be up to up air, maybe a force smash raw near the ledge, like something like at this point playing away and throwing bombs and stuff, it's no longer gonna work. Like you don't you just don't have enough time to to rack it with that much damage that fast. And he had a bomb in his hand right there, so that that dash in by uh, by Candy was completely, almost completely safe. Yeah. He needs to he needs to get back, he needs to get on stage without a bomb in his hand, so that tilt can come off. Him. Uh -oh. One minute left. Candy's at kill percent, or not Candy? Uh, wins at kill percent. Fox is basically at kill percent right now. Too. Like if he gets an S match, I could probably kill. Ooh, a boomerang. That was that was pretty slick. Uh oh. Car with a rapid jab. <laughs> Alright, he's at kill percent at near the ledge. Oh, I tried to catch him with the two frame. He almost did it. Yeah. The boomerang could have hit him into it. That would have been so tragic for Fox. That's it, the Tiltomatic 5000. I wonder if he sees my greatest, my greatest invention. There's 10 seconds of candy. Run! Oh, rip. Okay, like, my god. I didn't, I didn't notice the time, like, until I said, like, there's a minute and 30 seconds left. Yeah. 